So, in my previous video on linear interpolation, I gave you a pretty big equation to find the value between two different terms in a table. And during an exam, that is kind of time consuming, and you can use that time on, well, actually solving other problems. So, I'm going to teach you a little shortcut using your calculator to uh, do a linear interpolation less than half the time. So, we're going to have to, uh, we're going to do the same linear interpolation that we did in the previous video. So it's going to, we're going to be looking at refrigerant R134A. Uh, we're looking for the enthalpy at 63 degrees. So first we're going to have to import the data from the, from the tables. So for that we're going to go stat, edit, and we're going to be using these two columns here. L1 is the x value in the, the, the equation that we were using, and y is the uh, L2 is the Y value. So we know it's at 63 degrees, so temperature is the X value. We have values at the table between 60 degrees and 70 degrees. So we're going to put those in L1. And the corresponding enthalpies is 291.36 kilojoules per kilogram. And the other one is 302. 0.34 kilojoules per kilogram. All right, so we're just going to exit back to the home screen now, and uh, what we're going to do is a linear regression line, which is the exact same thing as what we're doing. We're just making a line between those two points, and we're going to look in between it. So the way you do that is we're going to go back to stat, so then we're going to arrow over to calc, fourth option, lin reg, and then just enter, enter, and we have our equation for it. So that's not enough right now. I mean, you could do it yourself from here on in with this equation, but it'd be easier just to have your calculator plot it for you. So we're going to go uh, to the y equals key, and we're going to call up that function. The way you do that is you go to VARS, down to statistics, that's option 5. Now we have a few more options. We're going to arrow over to EQ, and the first option there is REGEQ, which stands for regression equation. And we're just going to pull it up. That's the exact same equation as we had in uh, on the home screen. So now that we have that, it's it's the calculator knows this equation. We can go to table, which is second graph, and here are the x and y columns. And if we type in 63, because we know it's at 63 degrees Celsius, there it, and there's our enthalpy, 294.65. Uh, which is what I should have gotten in the last video. Made a little bit of a typo. But that is how you do linear interpolation with a calculator.